Hey, what's going on, everybody? My name is Kyle Lay, and today I'm going to show you how to get Charcadet, Armor Rouge, and Cerulege in Pokemon Scarlet and Pokemon Violet. You can actually get access to Charcadet very early in the game. It's a static encounter for both versions, so you're going to be able to see him walking around in the overworld at the spot I'm going to show you. And uh, the first thing you're going to want to do is head over to Cortando. I'm at the, uh, the, the West Side Pokemon Center here just because it's closer. And we're going to hop on our funny dragon motorcycle legendary guy, and we're going to go up this path here. Now, I'm actually giving away a copy of Scarlet or Violet once we reach 35,000 subscribers. So if you'd like a chance to win that, all you have to do is subscribe to the channel, give this video a thumbs up, and leave a comment down below letting me know which game you would prefer to have. And if we can reach 40,000 subscribers, I'll actually give away three copies. Now, coming up here on this path, once it starts to veer left, we're actually going to stay straight and we're going to go into the grass, into that little hole in the the wall area back there, which is going to give us a patch of grass where Charcadet is just back here vibing, okay? So the first thing we're going to want to do is capture this guy, and it's pretty low level. It's probably like level 15. Like I said, you get it really early in the game. Um, level 14, there you go. Okay, so we just went ahead and caught Charcadet. Now I'm going to show you what you need to do to obtain the Auspicious Armor if you're playing Pokemon Scarlet or the Malicious Armor if you're playing Pokemon Violet. Because remember, it's already been revealed that Armor Rouge is exclusive to Pokemon Scarlet and Cerulege is exclusive to Pokemon Violet. Ultimately, we're going to end up in the same spot. However, the journey to get there is slightly different. So I'm going to go to the area and then I'm going to tell you what you need to do so please uh, just follow along and don't skip ahead. It'll be very short and sweet, I promise. Okay, if you're playing Pokemon Scarlet, how to obtain the auspicious armor is very simple. What you need to do is go to any of these spots on the map. If you want to go ahead and screenshot this, you're going to want to KO or capture 10 Bronzor. You could also do Bronzong, I guess, technically, but Bronzor, they're much lower level and they're pretty common as far as the map goes. And this also works with the let's go mechanic, whether you're pressing, you know, R1 or R2, RZ, whatever it is, where you send out your guy and you just KO them. You're able to pick up those items because every time you KO or capture a Bronzor, it drops a Bronzor fragment and you're going to need 10 of those. Okay. Now to all my Violet gamers, I'm sorry. It is much more difficult to obtain Saru Ledge than it is to get Armor Rouge because you have to get 10 Sinisty chips. And if you want to go ahead and screenshot this part of the map here, Sinisty only spawns in two locations on the map, and they're like level 40, okay? Now, I still was able to get my Cerulege uh, with my team being like level 22, 23-ish. And the way that I was able to do this was I just captured one of the wild Sinisty, and then I used that Sinisty to go the other ones. And it didn't obey me because I only had like two badges, right? Okay, now if you're playing Pokemon Scarlet, you have your... 10 Bronzor Fragments, and if you're playing Pokemon Violet, you have your 10 Sinisty Chips. All you need to do now is head over to Zapapico. Um, sorry, here on the map. Again, I'm at the west side just because it's, it's uh, closer to where I need to be. And we are going to go ahead and hop on our Dragon Motorcycle Dude, and we're going to go down this ramp, and we're going to head over here and talk to this NPC. Now, since I'm playing Violet, it is going to be this lady here. And if you're playing uh, Scarlet, it's going to be a, a gentleman here who's going to ask you for bronze or fragments, right? But since I'm playing Violet, she is a lover of Sinisty, and she wants 10 Sinisty chips. So I say yes, I go ahead and give her those, and she rewards me with the malicious armor. Now again, if you're playing Scarlet, he's going to want 10 bronze or fragments, and he will give you the auspicious armor. Now, you just go into your bag, you go over here into like your rare candy item-ish slot, here it is, the Malicious Armor. We're going to go ahead and... It's a usable item, consumable item. And as you can see, Charcadet can use it. And boom, there's no level requirement, of course. Oh, nice, the wall's in the way. <laughs> but here it is, we're evolving. And there you go, simple enough. So like I said, please do subscribe if, uh, if you're new. And give the video a thumbs up, it'll help me out a lot. And I hope you enjoy your playthrough of Scarlet and Violet with your new Armor Rouge or Cerulege. Have a good one.